everybody, I'm Ashley Skeva, and it's time for another installment of Just Show Me on Tekka TV, where we take your tech toys and gadgets and show you how to get the most out of them. Today I'm going to show you how to check your data usage on your iPhone. Now, data plans can get really expensive if you exceed your limit, and most carriers do have a data limit. So you definitely want to know how to check what your iPhone's using and how much data it's used during the month to make sure your bill doesn't get crazy. Let's take a look. So we'll unlock our iPhone, and from the home screen, we want to go into settings. And from settings, we're going to look for the general tab. So we'll scroll down, and you'll see general there. And once we get into the general section, we actually want to look for usage, which should be in the top category. Once we click on usage, you'll see some general information about your iPhone, what apps are stored on it, how much hard drive space is taking up on your phone. If you scroll down, however, you'll see an option for cellular usage, and you can tap on that. Now, once we get into usage, we can see different kinds of information about what our phone has been doing. We have call time, cellular network data, and tether data. The one you most want to be concerned with is cellular network data. If you look at sent, you'll see how much information your phone has sent out into the network, and if you see received, you'll see how much it's brought in. Now, received is going to be the more important one because that counts for all your downloads, any streaming you might do through your data network. If you use Netflix or any other movie or television watching service on your phone, you definitely want to keep an eye on that received. Now, most people's data plans are anywhere between 2 and 5 gigabytes of data a month. And you can see on ours, we have a pretty low amount of data used so far, so we don't have to worry just yet. But we definitely want to check back in throughout the month and make sure that we're not going to cross over that threshold. Now, if you scroll down all the way, you'll see a reset statistics button, which will allow you to reset your cycle and your usage tracking for the month. So once your billing cycle is done, go back in there, hit reset statistics, and you can find out exactly how much data you're using over the course of a month. That's been Just Show Me on Tekka TV. Be sure to check out Tekka.com for all of our other content, and we'll see you next time.